a flux. But let us pull it support flux. The effect it produces is perfect. You don't need to convert other models to use the CIT. Here is a simple normal flux workflow. Generate. The effect is perfect, right? Compared with the previous SDXL, flux generation is better. I will introduce it in detail later. This is using flux. CNN large model. Defim assume in HD. This effect is more detailed. My details are perfect in one step. I use this here. If you don't mind local installation, can be used directly online. Open my Endbrain Cloud image. Then I open all my workflows. If you can see this flux bullet at the specified face row image. That means update to the latest version. This is an updated version. It should be updated to the latest version in the next two days. You can use it online. No need to consider local deployment. Model CTC. What I can do now, you can also use. Don't worry about reporting errors or other such issues. If you deploy locally, you can click on My. Note. Open the comfy way tutorial. We'll jump to this. Workflow location. This is a bit slow to open. Refresh. My notes record my learning process. Multi tiles, suitable for local deployment. There are model downloads and workflows inside. Download. There are also some installed. Precautions. In this image version, Comfy UI Mirror. The first one is. Then this is its node. Installation and model download. Location. Also. This model must be downloaded again and replaced with a new model. This is also the location after decompression. The workflow has a simple introduction to usage. Screenshots and workflow download. This can just download it in my notebook. Create this Confuity tutorial. We'll jump to here. Select the image version because the image is large. So it will be divided into two versions in the future. Currently still. This is convenient for people who don't want to deploy. OK, back to this one. Here is a simple workflow. E, e won't introduce This is a node it. for model download and installation. Workflow. You have to pick up these three. OK, this is a high definition zone, mainly this control net that supports flux. Upscaler. It should be read like this. This is a large model. Amplify it through. But simply scaling up the model is not enough. You need to pass the lower. I have all here. Many models are already built in. Just use it directly. No need to consider local deployment. A skin detail is used here. To increase the skin details. And add all the details. As for a trigger word of the prompt word. I will read it in the notes next to this. You can click on it to see the contents inside. 
this portrait a trigger word to increase skin detail. Besides, Alora with added details. If there is no trigger word with none, this means that his Laura does not need a trigger word. This makes it convenient for everyone to use. My online mirror. If you don't understand, there will be annotations on the side. Just click to view. For example, if you don't understand, this, I'll put an annotation next then to it. Then it's as a prompt word. I don't know. Because it needs to take the previous prompt word. But because your HD restoration requires adding trigger words. So I added a. Just A plus B. Here is to fill in the trigger words and some HD prompt words. Then B is the previous prompt word. Think directly here. In this way, A plus B is achieved. Each combination of this is a prompt word. Then send it to the sampler to generate the image. The final details are Perfect. The details of the skin also have weight. I just watch the increase. For example, I will change another one here to generate. The advantage of using a mirror is that you can now see that I can use. Then you can also use, so there is no error or anything. Because the images are exactly the same. You open it and it's exactly the same as mine. All of these workflows are also in. But this requires the platform to be updated to the latest because version. of the latest workflow, I update slow people. platform updates. For example, this generation is still a relatively vague state. After zooming in here, it will be very high definition. A face of this character. The weight of extraction here is also adjusted according to the situation. If you want to increase his weight, you should make him more realistic. Then you can increase his weight. This is usually disabled. Because you need to go to high-tech repair after you are satisfied with the first generation. Otherwise, there is no point in taking the next step. If you are not satisfied with this step, there is no need to proceed to the next step. So here is a separate group. The focus here is the enlarged model of this C, and plus this LoRa, the add detail and skin detail. The combination of the three can achieve the effect of ultra high definition restoration. For example, this is the eyebrow before repair. The skin is blurry. After it is trimmed, the edges are very clear. Hair, also, all of these. Very clear. Compare the effects. So this is perfect. Okay, let's go play.